Martin, shoot or work? Uh, no, no, it's it's happening. Uh, it's see, this is the thing that people for people who were saying like it could be a work and stuff. All the reports that came out before WWE announced it, they were all confirmation. This was confirmation that Dean had said that he was leaving after his contract had ended. Then WWE put out the statement saying um, that you know Dean is going after April. And even then, more confirmation came out that Dean said, look, he, he, Dean hasn't left the WWE. He's still in contract with him, and he's happy to still work for him. But at the end of the day, he has told Vince, and he's told the higher management, whoever he said, he sat down with meetings of him, um, it even spans over the, in the course of the weekend of the Royal Rumble. Um, apparently, he was talking all weekend to management, saying that he had no plans <clears throat> or no desire to um, sign a new contract. They offered him um, a million a year contract over five years. Uh, he rejected that. He turned that down. And he said he's not about the money. He just wants to leave. So it, it's confirmed that he want, that he's just going when his contract ends. So for WWE to put this out now when the news broke did make sense. But obviously people have seen it as a work because it's not something WWE normally do. But again, news like this doesn't normally break. If someone's leaving and the news breaks, it's it's within a couple of weeks or a few weeks of the contracts. It's not months and months down the line. So um, it does make sense for WWE to write him off TV if they're not going to. Um, but then again, they could still use him for TV. But unfortunately for Ambrose, I think there's a chance he'll end up getting squashed and a bit shit on. But even the even at the Royal Rumble, um, you know, it, this it, this wasn't confirmed. But the big talk around it was that the big plan with the Royal Rumble was going to heavily involve Dean Ambrose. And then with these talks ending how they did over the weekend, they changed it to the Nia Jax thing. So. It, it, for me, it's not a work. It, everything that I've read is confirmation. So for me, he's going. It just depends on if WWE want to use him for a build-up of Mania for anything. And again, you know, if they put him in a match with Triple H, that guy hasn't won a WrestleMania match in a long time. So it would kind of make sense for him to go over Dean Ambrose, considering everyone knows that he's leaving. But uh, I don't know. What do you think Why? about it? Why would you give Dean Ambrose the rub, or what they believe is a rub of facing Triple H at WrestleMania? Um, I, you say that you think it's he's leaving. A lot of people have said, yep, he's leaving. But I just can't get my head round why they'd allow, as I said to you over text, why they'd allow Dean Ambrose to belittle Triple H on Raw. They put him in a prominent spot. He faced Seth Rollins. Yet he lost. He then looked like he was about to deliver a pipe bomb after the match. It just, do we as soon as they know someone's going? Take Neville. As soon as they knew what was going with Neville, that was it. We never saw Neville again. He was never mentioned. He was essentially written out. Yeah, but so Neville I, I Neville just, did refuse to work for WWE. I like, just, I, Ambrose isn't refusing to work for him. Ambrose is just saying he's, he's leaving. And I, I, I don't. Th by the look, by the by the way they've worded that um, that press release that they did, it sounds to me like they weren't even a hundred percent sure Dean was leaving over the weekend. And then when it turned out after Raw that this was a genuine thing and the news broke, it sounds to me like they've just accepted defeat and gone, right, let's just write him off. So if we see him next week, we see him, but there's a good chance we're not going to see this guy again. I think if we see him on Monday, it's story. I really, I just feel like this could just be the use of it to build Triple H Ambrose. I'm probably yeah. wrong. I think it's just the paranoid wrestling fan. I'm just used <laughs> to being worked on stuff. 